In this video, I will tell you all the important books that you need to buy for your CCMP course and we are starting right now. Hey, this is Dr. Vinash. Welcome to video number two in which I tell you about all the important subjects, the textbooks that you need to buy to get amazing knowledge and fantastic marks in your CCMP course. These books that I'm going to discuss are recommended by Maharashtra University of Health Sciences, Nashik, and they are the most preferred books. Now, I will also be adding my personal reviews of these books and whether I think you should buy them or not. The links to all these textbooks will be given in the description box below so that you can buy it from the safety of your home, right? Let's start with the first important subject, which is pharmacology. The first textbook I am discussing is called as Essentials of Medical Pharmacology by K.D. Tripathi. This is my number one choice for MBBS students, BDA students and anybody who needs to do pharmacology properly. This book is so brilliantly written. It has nice diagrams, flowcharts, easy to understand textual language and if you follow this textbook, you have a comprehensive understanding of entire pharmacology. The drugs are described in good amount of details. No extra nonsense has been mentioned. And as a result, this book gets my five star rating. A definite must buy. The second textbook recommended by Maharashtra University of Health Sciences is Pharmacology and Pharmacotherapeutics by Satoskar. This book is good. It is bigger book as compared to Tripathi. It has much more descriptive text in it. But my personal feeling is this book describes too much. And as a result, this is not my favorite book. I give it a solid four star out of five. It's still a good book for people who love to read a textbook, which is much more descriptive, much more story like so that you get a better understanding of the subject but not my recommendation the third textbook recommended by MUHS is Kadzen basic and clinical pharmacology by Kadzen this is a beautiful 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 textbook by Lang publication this textbook is so beautiful that I recommend it to all my MBBS students but because we are focusing on CCMP, this is not a textbook to be bought, according to me. So even though this textbook is amazing, it gets a thumbs down for me from CCMP perspective. The fourth textbook that MUHS recommends is Clinical Pharmacology by Morris J. Brown. This textbook is beautiful. It gets a solid four star out of five from my side. But this textbook is too big to be studied for CCMP perspective. So not my personal recommendation. Now, which textbook to buy for pharmacology then? My number one pick would be KD Tripathi. Please study that. There are many other shortcut textbooks available. But it is my personal opinion that the level of your income as a medical professional depends on the level of your knowledge and the level of your confidence. See, your confidence would be high in treating your patients when your knowledge is rock solid. If you use a shortcut textbook, it will have a shortcut effect on your income. If you have a good standard textbook, your knowledge would be solid, your ability to treat the patient would be better, and that's why I don't recommend any shortcut textbooks. There are quite a lot available. And as you join your colleges for CCMP, you will realize which textbooks I'm talking about. But they are not my favorite textbooks, not my recommendations, not even MUHS recommends those books. So please stay away from those textbooks. Please buy uh, KD Tripathi. That would give you good knowledge, good base to practice your pharmacology. And of course, when you have a good base, your confidence level rises, your income level rises. So I hope you understand the significance of getting good books. Now, apart from pharmacology, there are many other subjects that you will have to study in CCMP. The first one of them is PSM or Preventive and Social Medicine. This 
is a beautiful beautiful subject if you love uh, you know social medicine if you love demographics if you love to see what is happening around you and as a good doctor i presume you already have a good idea of what diseases are prevalent in your community right this book will make you more sharper and more focus on these diseases on how these diseases are spread and what you can do as a doctor to prevent them from happening the textbook i'm talking about for psm is parks textbook of preventive and social medicine this textbook gets a five star rating from me this is too good of a textbook so i highly recommend you take this textbook too the next subject that is supposed to be studied in ccmp is medicine right now as far as medicine is concerned mhs recommends api textbook of medicine which is amazing textbook it gets a super duper five star rating from me the problem with this textbook according to me is because your ccmp course is only of one year you're supposed to do pharmac psm medicine surgery obstetrics gynecology and pediatrics you can't finish api textbook of medicine in one year and hence it gets a thumbs down from me as far as ccmp is concerned but if you want to buy a textbook for knowledge this is the textbook to go to so what other textbook can you refer during your ccmp to score good marks and to get decent amount of knowledge about diseases well i recommend a textbook called as the preparatory manual of medicine uh, written by matthews okay k george matthews this textbook gets my five star rating it's an ideal textbook used by mbbs and bbs students also and it gives you short concise point wise answers to specific questions you need to know about diseases so yes george matthews k george matthews gets a massive thumbs up from my side must buy now apart from medicine you also need to study pediatrics which would be treating children right the ideal textbook for this is ghai essential pediatrics ghai's textbook is amazing it gives you descriptive answers descriptive topics but it's very simple it's very nice uh, it it has a beautiful easy to understand language and hence this gets a massive thumbs up from me as far as ccmp is concerned now after pediatrics you need to also focus on surgery general surgery and here my recommended textbook is manipal manual of general surgery or manipal manual of surgery this textbook is amazing it gives you good photographs so you understand the diseases better it has nice fluid explanation it has point wise answers and this is my number one choice book for ccmp surgery studies in ccmp you also need to study obstetrics and gynecology for obstetrics the recommended textbook is going to be datta's textbook of obstetrics and for gynecology i prefer using a textbook called as shaw's textbook of gynecology both these textbook get five star rating from me this is a very very important buy you should take this because well as you know understanding the basis of female reproductive organs and applying that knowledge to various diseases is so important and for you know delivering babies that's so important these textbook gives you beautiful concept based understanding of various diseases that affect the female reproductive tract uh, and of course the problems that can arise during pregnancy and labor and in the puerperium so these are my recommended textbooks datta's textbooks of obstetrics and shaw's textbook of gynecology both of them five star beautiful books once you're done with the theory part you also need to understand that there is a clinical aspect up you know attached to the ccmp course so you need to do some clinics also so during your rounds in various wards and various postings you will realize that the the doctors there are referring to certain clinical uh, you know textbooks 
my recommendation and university's recommendations are mentioned in the next few minutes university recommends hutchinson's clinical method as a textbook for medicine trust me this book is amazing if i could have given it more stars i would have given it 10 stars out of 5 this book is too good the problem is because of the limited time that you have reading a textbook like hutchinson's clinical method is not recommended so from ccmp perspective i would definitely say no to hutchinson's clinical methods but yes to another textbook called as bedside clinics in medicine this is written by uh, kundu okay this is a beautiful beautiful textbook kind of manual uh, for understanding the clinical aspects okay how do you present a good case in medicine how do you uh, answer questions about drugs that are asked x-rays ecgs um, it also gives you pretty good understanding of various instruments that you need to know from your medicine perspective so yes kundu's bedside clinics in medicine gets a massive massive thumbs up from ccmp perspective five star book please buy these for surgery you need to buy something called as clinical uh, sorry a manual on clinical surgery this is by s das this book gives you case wise description of various diseases that you will encounter in your general practice this is the book to refer in case you get a surgery case in your exams and trust me there are a lot of important surgery questions that can come this book gets a solid five star rating from me i have used it mbbs students use it bbs students use it from cpa ccmp perspective this textbook gets a massive massive thumbs up from my side too please use this or if you don't want uh, you can take it from library but i would really recommend buy it as far as obstetrics and gynecology is concerned we need to take a textbook called as practical obstetrics and gynecology by virkud ajit virkud amazing textbook everything that you need from the clinical perspective of obstetrics and gynecology is mentioned in a beautiful manner in this textbook so this is according to me a must buy and it's a very simplified uh, you know textbook beautiful easy to understand language so it will definitely help you in your uh, obstetrics and gynecology cases and the last textbook that you need to buy from clinical perspective is practical aspects of pediatrics my favorite professor my favorite uh, doctor actually is mr mayur k cheda this textbook gets a solid five star rating from me and from ccmp perspective this textbook is a must buy textbook uh, because the way in which a pediatric case is supposed to be presented is way different from uh, a medicine case or a surgery case this book gives you literally step by step process that you need to do to get a great pediatric case so there you have it all the textbooks that you need to buy for your ccmp course i hope that you have got selected in this year's ccmp my next video is going to be about the syllabus that you need to cover from these textbooks in ccmp the bare minimum what you need to know plus what is a good to know topic all that thing will be covered in my next video stay tuned if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please do that give it a thumbs up and please share these videos with your colleagues uh, with other doctors share it on your whatsapp group so that everybody knows about ccmp they become aware of what ccmp is and more importantly they too can upgrade their knowledge and their life till the next time we meet this is dr avinash signing off for now take care keep rocking bye bye